Welcome into the Desert Dudes. It is time for the race of Desert Dudes. We got race number six. It's the full race here at Desert Dudes. Let's take a look at our total standings right after race number five. As you see, Glare holds a two-point lead of a whale, with Brad being in third place, Shark in fourth. Now, here we go. We're about to head over to the 15-lap shootout here at the Desert Dudes. I'm Sam Opeka, and I'll be your commentator for this extreme race here. As you can see, 182 funnels. It's going to be a well-designed race, especially for these marbles. All 16 of them are ready to go. Down the floor they go here in lap number one. And nothing has happened right now. Oh, there they go. There they go. So I guess a little bit of a giant hand had to push there. Anyways, we're inside in that first funnel. Volcano holding the lead. Followed by Penguin, it looks like the Ivory coming all the way in. And who's going to be able to take it into lap number two? Oh, it's Tripper. Tripper, easy, fast as lap so far with 18.71. Amazing job for Tripper just getting inside and taking the lead out. Let's see how these mobiles really recommend their action as we move now to lap number two out of 15 here in race six. And they are off once again. These mobiles are ready to duke it out. Glare with the lead. He has the lead in the standings just by the way, but only two points over Whale. Glare, can he be able to master and take the lead? No, it's Invasion, then it's Dripper. And there goes Carrot in third. The home marble doing doing everything. This is the home of Carrot. Glare coming in through. And then all the other marbles just dropping on through too. I think that's, yeah, that's Whale. That should be Whale that just dropped on three just now. And then the last two, looks like that's Rainforest. And that is Ivory or Penguin? It's one of the two. Looks like Penguin. It's not Ivory. It looks like Penguin. Anyways, we are about to head up into lap number three. 15 laps is a crazy margin of a shootout right here. Especially when you're going into through these funnels right here. And there they go. I think somebody just fell off the course. We'll have to check on it. Check on it. Not Marvel. Right there. But they fell onto a soft surface. You know, probably a hard surface or medical. Mobiles will be able to help him out right there. Anyways, we got Volcano with a nice win. Nice cut through over Glare. The invasion there. There they go. Right into that funnel. Flame about to drop next. Well, yes, it will be Flame. Then all the others just coming on through in this intense, electrifying, the dominant performance of racing, you know? Anyways, let's head over to lap number four. As Carrot does finish the course. Oh, we do have a fall off. It is going to be Dripper. We didn't even see where Dripper fell off at, but that's who fell off. It looks like. Now we're moving on to lap number four as these mobiles get off. And well, woo! He just jumped the track. I think he got disqualified off of lap number four, so he's going to drop down into last place. Woo, whale! That is not good right there already. I was at the first funnel. You got these marbles just rolling. They're down in the bottom funnel. Who's going to be able to take a shark? Look like they have this side corner. No, it's Glare. Glare just doing everything he can to stay in front and ahead of the leader right now. The lead is still going to be Glare's right now. All the marbles trying to knock out. Knock out. Nobody has beat the fastest lap so far with the 1871 by, by Dripper. Nobody's beat that, but we'll see if anybody manages to beat it with the upcoming last few laps. Now let's look up the replay here, because Whale apparently jumped the track. Oh, right there for that 180. He jumped right over the red funnel and then just down the blue funnel, so who go to last? You can't jump the track. You're not supposed to jump the track. That is not good for Whale, but at least you still have a few more laps to get through. Actually, more than a few, but there's, there's, plen there's plenty more room uh, for trial and error. Anyways, that's Billboard has the lead. Can you keep it? Flame in there. Flame! Well, when it rainforest, glare, whale, all beaten. Dripper to the finish line, especially, especially Dripper and Billboard. 
actually, I meant billboard. They all be, be billboard to the uh, finish line, but all those marbles keep on coming through this next generation of laps. We was having some technical difficulties trying to get this lap uploaded, but no worries, because we're already doing it right now. Lap number six out of 15 has begun. That's all the marbles, now they all go down the course. Did somebody just fall off? I think so. I don't see billboard. To be honest, so wonder what a real billboard is at. The marbles are inside the second dish. Well, some of them are, not all of them. Some of them are. That's no, that's not volcano. That's that is volcano that takes home the the action packed win. Lap number six. Kira trying to make the best of his ability in race battles. Can these mobiles really maintain their composure? Because they've been racing for a long, long time. And these laps, they were getting exhausted. So that's why they're taking a big from those laps. Or oh, Billboard fell off, we heard. So Billboard will not be, well, they will be starting last in the start of the race, of lap seven. But we will see how it turns out as we go into that lap right now. All the marbles are going inside. Penguin edging the lead right now. And there they go. Right off of lap number seven's enthusiasm. Let's see how the blue funnel goes. Pickle with an extremely good fastest lap right there. 16 to 7. Can anybody come off with that time? Right there. 16 to 7 is an amazing time by Pickle. Let's see how all the marbles manage to documentary it. Glare falling all the way back down to 14th. I think that was Molecule, and then it's carried the drops down to last. But there's a few more laps still left as we head over to lap number eight. These moles are ready to roll. And Carrot's getting stuck right there, right in open finishes. Carrot, not good for that mobile right there, but still a few more laps is remaining. Carrot getting stuck right before... The first one even opens. I think that's Flame with the win. As all of these other redemption marbles, they trying to redeem for extra points trying to win. Glare in the lead in the standings, but it could change at any point in these races, especially when we get into the final few races we got. And yes, that's where Karen got stuck at. Right there in the dominant performance. I heard a, the, another marble fell off. Oh, actually, two of them did. It's Bill Board and Red. They fell off the course. Two marbles. Never seen that before. I don't think we've seen that before. But yeah, that's literally not, not, not good. But let's see if that's same thing happened. Okay, Karen did not get stuck in that 180 this time. Karen's in the funnels right now. The red dish, to be exact. Karen's in last right now. That's that's the home marble. And Glare, by the way, takes the wind and whale. Coming in, Dripper. Coming in, Volcano and Rainforest. Making their debut inside of the course here. It's a very good course. Two funnels with that 180 at the start. And then that, that, that jump by whale in lap number four was not a good jump. Because you can't be jumping a lot of oil. You're just stun the back of the pack. And this time, Monkey fell off. So I don't know what's going on. But a lot of marbles it's like to fall off off of that 180. And 180 is tricking, tricking these marbles. I wonder how they're going to talk to themselves about how how they're going to be able to race in, in race 7 all the way to number 10. Because that 10 is when we end this fumble tournament. Anyways, that's Volcano that holds the lead. Now, oh, Glare with a nice battle. Good check inside for his shark. Over Ivory. Then it's Monkey. It looks like Penguin. Oh, there goes all the marbles. Documentary inside Rainforest. Then there goes Carrot. Can, can they take over a little bit of do documentary? Dripper. Beating bread to the finish line. At the end there. Now let's go to lap number 11. Volcano holds the lead. There goes all the marbles. They're just waiting to, ready to race. They are just eager at seeing who will be able to take it down the course. That looks like Monkey that has the lead. If it's not Monkey, then it's Molecule. But it does look like Monkey that takes the that takes home the lead. He's getting pummeled out by the other marbles, though. Carrot looks like that. No, just Dripper. Dripper just comes out of nowhere with an inside corner cut. 
takes the lead and leads it into lap number 12 that we're going to be in. Just shortly, moments away before the races ever take on and begin. Billboard with an excellent race there. Rainforest to jump at the last. But no worries as we get to race number six. This is the 12th lap. We are here at this dome for a reason, you know? And the marbles are just coming off. I think one marble just fell off the course or just jumped the track. I think it was Jumper. Jumper, though, had, had a finishing, finishing touches on the course. Don't even worry about how Tripper just didn't. He's just that there in lap number 12. Well, looks like they can't conquer it. And then it's going to be Volcano and all the other bubbles just jumping on through. There's Penguin trying to get into a hold of flame. Yes, Penguin had a hold of flame right there. Glare is dropping back to last, it looks like. Oh, no, wait, never mind. It's Invasion that's dropping back to last, technically. We've had, I think, a... Uh, fall off. No, we did not. <laughs> we didn't have anything there. So now we're going to lap number 13. There they go as Giant Hand pushes them in as all the marbles realm inside of lap number 13. That is Rainforest, the ti Tigers the lead right now. Can he be able to keep it? None of these marbles are really able to keep the lead. Not even at one point. In the race, clear looking like to have it. No, that's Tripper again. Bread and all the other marbles are just trying to get dominant, trying to get fancy with it. And Carrie just jumps all the way back down the last. The the home marble not doing well with this home streak start. He's trying to do a little bit off the off the charts. He's trying. He's not doing well. He did. He wasn't last. As Penguin did manage to hit last. Now coming down to the final two laps. We have here at Desert Dunes. One of the former Desert Marble Caraps in this alternative tournament right here. There's where Billboard has to, has to has push himself through. Into the blue funnel. Who's going to take the lead? Glare looks like to have it so far. Glare, can he keep it? Yes, he can. Then it's going to be Rainforest and all the other marbles trying to get in dominant fashion for what an amazing race this has been so far. There's Invasion getting inside and the final four marbles now get in their carrot. No boy. Then they got Dripper beating out Ivory. Yes, it will be Dripper. So Dripper taking 15th place so far, but we have one lap left. Down. This is for the medals. Who is going to be able to take it down for the medals? The marbles are rolling. Some marbles needed to be helped by the giant hand, but now they can't be helped by the giant hand anymore. All the marbles trying to get inside. Who will be able to take that gold here at Desert Dudes? It's going to be looks like Shark. There's Penguin in silver and Carrot with the bronze. That's your podium right there. Invasion following fourth. And all the other marbles following. Rainforest following. Bread. Glare. Dang that. Yeah, it's Ivory because the Penguin got silver. Yes, Ivory. Then here comes Flame. And Molecule taking last place. Not good for Molecule because that's plus zero. There. I wonder what that's going to do to the standings. But first, let's congratulate our podium finishers. Shark, Penguin, and Carrot. Shark with the gold, Penguin, Silver, and Carrot at his home field advantage. The bronze. Shark right there. The plus 23 up on the podium. The yeah, Penguin, Carrot, Invasion down there. Pickle Volcano, Billboard, and Monkey round out the top eight. And now taking our total standings. One point lead for Whale. Taking it over Glare. Then you got Shark in third. Bread Dom dominating down the fourth. Billboard, Monkey, Pickle, and Carrot roll down at the top eight. Then you got Volcano all the way down to Invasion that is remaining. Now, thank you for being great audiences and stay tuned as we make it our way to race number seven. Peace out, everybody.